there's a few important takeaways from this module, so let's go over those now. The first one is that all processes have variation, and really there's no practical exception to that. Every process you come across, no matter how tightly controlled, will have some level of variation. So let's recognize that processes have variation. The second uh, point or takeaway that I'd like to make is that managing averages never serves an organization well. Um, an average uh, as a model is not a great representation of, of the data when the data is highly dispersed. And so world-class organizations don't manage averages, they manage the variation. And the example I like to use for this is McDonald's. You can go to McDonald's anywhere in the world and they're very consistent in the food, the food preparation and the food delivery. And so no matter where you are in the world, the experience for the customer is the same and of course that's what we want. Think of it in the context of this, your favorite go-to restaurant uh, or other retail outlet, chances are you like them and frequent them because of their consistency in, in your expectation. So that's the second takeaway. The third ta takeaway has to do with the definition of Six Sigma. By definition, Six Sigma uh, exists when we have six standard deviations between the average of the data set and a specification limit of some kind. And that's represented numerically by two defects per billion opportunities. So two defects for B for billion. Not the more common 3.4 defects per million, which you do tend to see in the literature and other uh, uh, textbooks and training for Six Sigma. It's generally thought as a 3.4 defects per million, but in fact, uh, this is not exactly right if we ignore the 1.5 sigma shift that uh, is presumed to take place in processes. So as processes live over time, their performance is thought to uh, degrade by about 1.5 sigma. And when you do that, then we get the 3.4 defects per million. But as we'll see in a later module in an exercise we'll do in Minitab, in fact, uh, to a statistician, or at least in terms of the standard normal distribution, uh, it is in fact two defects uh, per billion opportunity is the definition of Six Sigma. So keep that in mind as you're talking to colleagues, uh, co-workers and others that have been trained in process improvement or Lean Six Sigma. And those are the four primary takeaways uh, from this module and uh, let's now go to the next module.